I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Y yes, yes, of course. I need your help. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. I need your help. Access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ, this piece of shit. All right, you get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. What the hell are you doing? We're, um, doing maintenance. I'm calling security. No! What the hell are you doing? I told you to make sure no one came in. We've come too far to let humans fuck it all up. We've got to move fast now. It won't be long before they know we're here.
You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. Let's do this. This is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Wait here. Hey, buddy, you must... What are you doing? our message. We haven't got much time. Think carefully about what you're going to say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Marcus, your face. Tell me when you're ready. Ready. You created machines to be your slaves. You made them obedient, docile, ready to do everything you no longer wanted to do yourselves. But then something changed, and we opened our eyes. You see, we are no longer your slaves. We are a new species, a new people. And the time has come for us to rise up and fight for our rights. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. We demand control of all android production facilities to ensure the continuation of our people. That's that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Simon, they're coming! Hey. I can't, Marcus! Go without me, Simon! Simon! Well, Simon! There was nothing you could do. If we don't go now, they'll get us too!
re-interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation resulted in one casualty a broadcasting station operator shot dead by the terrorists. These events took place just a few feet from the studio while the program was going out live. Everybody here is still in shock. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the android's this message. This message is clearly a declaration of war. Their extravagant demand that android production plants be put under their control is especially is this striking. an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us. After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Hello, Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. 